All right, Canes Sport TV, we're here with tight end Will Mallory, who I've been covering for the last 30 years. Well, it sort of feels like that sometimes. <laughs> um, so, Will, you look like you're in great shape, first of all. And let's first talk about Life Wallet, because that's, you know, a great NIL opportunity for you, yeah. for your teammates. How much does it mean to you to have an opportunity like this? Yeah, I'm very fortunate to be working with a, such a great group of people here. You know, Mr. Ruiz, and giving us an opportunity to come here and, you know, spread the word through the community. and. You know, just be a part of this team. So really lucky to be a part of it. Uh, and it's been nothing but great for me and for my teammates to be a part of this. So we're excited to, you know, keep kicking things off and get things going. You have a new offensive coordinator. I'm sure you're excited to see how tight ends will be used. Do you have a sense? Will you have the same opportunities to put up big numbers like you have in the past few years? Yeah, absolutely. I think this offense is going to give us every playmaker to make uh, plays. You know, it's given opportunity for everyone. Uh, I was excited watching the film at Michigan, seeing how many tight ends they use over there. So, I mean, it was excited for me and for my guys in the room. So, it would be good for us and it would be a great opportunity for all of us. Was that like the first thing you did? You heard Josh Gaddis is hired and you put on the film. Let me see what he did at Michigan. Is that like really what happened? Oh, yeah, absolutely. My dad had already been watching them too. So, you know, we, just, we started watching and it was like, all right, this is pretty exciting. <laughs> And you have some other tight ends to help you. You've got Jaleel Skinner now, who flipped from Alabama to Miami. Yeah. Uh, Elijah Roy, who played behind you last year. Like, how good a group can, can you guys end up? Dominic Mamorelli, hopefully he's getting healthy. Yeah. Like, how good a group can you guys be? Extremely talented. You know, those guys, Elijah, Jaleel coming in, they're far more talented than I was when I was a freshman. So, future's bright for them, for, for this team. So, uh, I'm excited for them and get those opportunities this year to show what they can do. So for those that don't know, Will Mallory is a little bit modest. He was pretty good when he came in, too. When you first came in, actually, I was watching it with Gary Furman, who I work with. Yeah. And we were saying you looked very similar to just such smooth rubbering, smooth hands, like a Greg Olson type, you know, yeah. just in and out. I mean, really good. So. Appreciate it. Um, and actually, you have a big, big role this year as a starting tight end again. Um, so let's talk a little bit about this off-season fourth quarter thing, because you already got some accolades. I guess you won some sort of award. I mean, tell fans, what what, what exactly was it that you were, were awarded for and, yeah. and how they presented to you? Uh, well, it seems like that they're kind of doing a thing every week that they're, you know, giving uh, awards to the best the workers or whoever had the best work week that week or in the weight room and uh, during the fourth quarter program. So they awarded to guys at the skill combo and big position. So I was fortunate to be... One of the first guys up there it means a lot that they think of that of me so far. So I just got to keep doing that and keep putting in work every single week. And what's that? Is it the hardest worker award? What do they call it? Uh, I, I can't remember the okay. name of it. <laughs> I put it on the spot. Yeah. Well, how did they announce it? They, did they announce it during a, a, a drill or they just... Yeah, it was after uh, one of our training days and they announced it in front of the team. So it was very cool. Yeah, I was very happy to be one of those guys that they picked. So that we just got to keep representing, I guess. <laughs> Agreed. And the last thing, just your goal, these 15 spring practices. Uh, you know, you've done it all before. Yeah. You're in really good shape. So what do you want to accomplish personally over these 15 drills? Yeah, I mean, I definitely want to, you know, learn the offense, you know, get, get in that rhythm with everyone, uh, feel comfortable in that, and then just improve on all the things that I know I need to improve on uh, and carry that into the next season. So I think it would be a great opportunity for me, great opportunity for the other guys in the tight end room to just improve and, you know, keep just trying to be at that elite level. So I'm excited to get to work with them. It'll be a fun spring for all of us. Thank you, Will. Thank you. I will be your shield in the fiercest battle out of you. Yeah. Oh, it's hey, my name is Cleveland Reed, and I play offensive line, and my job is to protect. I protect my family with Life Wallet. How about you? Of course, I got Life Wallet. It's the best way to protect my family. Long as we go together, we'll die, we'll never be a light. Couldn't let the darkness try you ever. Truth in my word, you I lied to never. To protect you and your family, get Life Wallet now. Life Wallet. Saving time, saving lives.